Hello, ladies, gents, and all the involuntary members of this community, the number of which keeps growing. Slightly concerning. So I'm a, I'm a little, a little concerned <laughs> for the diversity of thought. Um, the number of slaves is growing a little too much. Are you ready, though, to find the problem solver? I'm looking forward to it so hard. Being trying to puzzle out what, who I want to send. It is serious business. Probably should send the elite team, not some shitty ass garbage dogs. <laughs> Just put in Blargo and T Rose, all the OGs, you know. In between episodes, I'd like to issue a bunch of commands, fix things that I have overlooked. Put a little bit of paint in the walls, just taking care of the little busy work things that only come up once I am uh, just staring at the damn thing without trying to come up with commentary. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, yeah, yeah. I also built a plasteel wall because I have a whole bunch of plasteel and it's like, I'm going to use it to build a wall. It's only 70 units. It's not that much. Basically, I, I was looking at the areas like, man, if a raid comes over here and they want to come this way, it's going to be a real bitch to defend. So let's put a wall so they can all peek around the wall. And we will uh, put a trap right at the tip. Get them wrecked. Actually, I shouldn't do it like that. You should like put the trap there. And what you put there is a piece of fence. There you go. I should also move this one. Hopefully nobody will trigger it by accident. Bunch of morons. Also scheduled a whole bunch of blocks to be moved to my dumping zone. Always running out of them. Using so many stones to build my empire. Alright. Okay. Get some time going forward. I want the... wonder if they... Uh, how are these idiots doing? Alright. Effing Damas has patched them up. So they are, when they, once they arrive, they're all properly ready to get cut to pieces for profit. <laughs> hey, Agri Hand has been. I also installed a bunch of more sleep accelerators that are going to be really, really helpful. Initiating mech birth. But what? Trade ship? Sweet. Hike? Go over there. Hopefully it will be... You need a power vertical trade beacon. Holy crap, I have not made them. Uh, emergency! Emergency over orbital trade beacon installations. We're going to put one there. Put one in the pantry. Always good to sell the excess meat. We're going to put one here for selling excess medicine. There's going to be wort and hops here. I need to set up a place to keep the beer, but it's nowhere to be seen yet, so it doesn't really matter just yet. Looking, looking good. And also, that's the problem with having the weapons out here. The orbital beacon doesn't really uh, cover them. I'll just put it here. Unfortunate. This really shouldn't be here, honestly. The, 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 these shelves of weapons outside is just not working out for me. I need to redo that somehow. Anyway, we're going to quickly... Drop whatever the hell you're doing, Blargo. You need to build these beacons. They are priority number one, so we can get rid of some goods. Uh, one there, one in here. Get rid of some goods. And hopefully get some good stuff. Okay, he's, he's, he's on it. He's on it! Pissing me off! Get it done! It is possible that... Actually, no, you cannot sell herbal medicine to a spacer trader. So that's going to be completely pointless. Go on called the lubricants. Freaking dregs, always so sad. Just get on with the program, dregs. We're going to convert you into our faith. What? Caravan arrived. All right, they're, they're back with a bunch of slaves. What, what, what? What's going on? Quest available. Contract prison. Sam Sammy Gerador. First mind of Butdinum <laughs> has captured four prisoners from an enemy faction. With no place to store them, Sammy wants to watch you to watch over them for nine days. Blah. The prisoners, prisoners are sick with blood rod, blah. The usual, they are going to just be bedridden, and you need to 
Actually, no, this is not bad written. They're just going to be wandering around like pieces of garbage. But, you know, they are prisoners. They're just going to be contained within the prison, prison of which we have enough space. Sammy's enemies have some... Have some provoked... What? Sammy's enemies have some provoked a mechanoid have. A little bit of a, of a pro, uh, problem with the, the typing of that quest, hunting the prisoners. So it will send mechanoid attack groups. There will be two raids of three lancers, four pikemen, and one scyther. We can take two raids of these. Look at these rewards. These are good. Holy crap. I'm really interested in the Archotech leg. I really don't care about the tech-proof subpersona core. How's that low-grade subpersona? The t teaching technology when you use the AI will teach you the technology. Uh, I was thinking about the ship persona. This is actually really good. Probably will go for this, even though the Silic Neuroformer is very nice. It's one of the few ways that you can become a better psyker when you're not allied with the Empire. So I am very much, you know, tentative with the Silic Neuroformer, but an Archotech leg makes upon so much faster uh we have five days though for now we're going to concentrate on getting that problem solver all right what can we possibly do here what do i want for this from these people all your neutramine all your camp fuel don't really know if i want the camp fuel because we just captured some boomalopes all your components for sure or advanced components uh, the hyperweb is nice, but it's, it's way too expensive. Can sell a lot. Probably have enough to cover most things. Let's just click on all the things that I want, and then, and then I will change my mind. Uh, you know, <laughs> as I realize that I don't have the purchasing power to get this done. We can get rid of 500. Oh, please, minus 500. Zero, zero. 500 human leather have all my ambrosia it is there to be sold don't really care about this jade honestly the uranium you don't really use a lot and i think there's a couple of veins we can sell a bunch plasteel rather not sell it we can die a bunch of i mean sell a bunch of dye mm, i don't care about the seed the garland seed it's just a chore to use honestly we have plenty of Mortars. Don't really want care about replacing them. We can sell our kidneys and our lungs. Oh, we're actually we're actually able to afford most. The reason why I have a prosthetic heart. I probably made it at some point because somebody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's somebody with a already blockage, so you probably don't want to to sell that. I'm always excited to browse through the wares of a spacer merchant super nice get rid of these cowboy hats don't care about this shirt it's so nice to be able to get rid of this garbage and the leather cape just get rid of it oh yes yeah. sell all this junk getting a lot more space in our inventory they're made of filthy cloth who cares about cloth when i can have human skin get rid of that human leather dust this is Blargo's original attire. I am I am uh, sentimentally attached to it, so we're not going to sell it. But I have been creating a bunch of dusters that, that are literally to sell. For the purposes of selling. And now we actually made a... Somehow, I profited out of all these purchases. That is insane to me. That hyperweave is super good to just um, give everybody regular clothes. That is so going to be so great. I'm going to schedule those jobs right away. Mm -mm -mm. What are these supposed to be? Just regular clothes, huh? We can now suspend these. The regular clothes garbage. Let me add a couple bills for Hyperweave. All right, done. We're going to be decked out. The drip is going to be through the roof. Absolute gorgeous outfits made out of hyperweave. Only people with 10 skill or more are going to be able to do it. All right, now that 
Oh yeah, yeah. We also have a couple. Uh... That's fine. A days is fine. We have new and exciting prisoners that have not been paying attention. Is the is the <laughs> um, caravan all set out already? Hey, uh, maybe. Okay, he's unloading elephant. I love it. Uh, how about you take elephant? Capture elephant. Oh, he's unwaveringly loyal. How? What a way to seal his fate. Not like it would have mattered because I brought them so that I can profit from the organs inside their body. But, you know, a bit tragic. A bit tragic. Dermeister is fully healed. All right. Insulting spree on scorpion? Buddy, I'm supposed to protect you. But you gonna get your ass beat. Let me just very gently punch you in the head, okay? I won't fail the... Oh, man. <laughs> I won't fail the quest. I will probably fail the quest if I keep punching him. Fine. You'll just provoke someone into punching you. It'll uh, certainly happen. Just insult the slaves. They deserve it. There you go. <laughs> this moron keeps provoking people into getting his head caved in. He's single-handedly destroying all the relations. I think this quest was like 17 days. There is a 0% chance of this guy. There were 17 days. 0% chance of this fellow surviving. And we have that quest going, which makes it... Let me rescue this idiot. Really no power reaches this thing. Oh, because it's supposed to be reconnected. There you are. Um, in the middle of saying something. 17 days. He ain't gonna make it. And we have those raids incoming. I cannot go out for the problem solver. Or I'm gonna have a real bad time when those the pile of people show up. We need to wait until the pile of people show up to be able to go out to grab this thing. And the security threats will activate in 2.3 days. That being said, I've done a number of retrievals of relics in the past. And there's like four mechs. It's really, really easy. Oh, an infection, huh? It's just a... Uh... Oh, I was like, an elephant? But... Animals don't usually get infections. It's just this guy's name is Elephant. The geezer is trying her best with her asthma and her frail torso and her artillery blockage to make it to places. We do have that prosthetic heart. Let's see who could use it best. Brain. The bionic stomach. Another eye missing. We really are in, in dire need of bionic eyeballs. All right. Seems like we only have one person with a weak heart, and that is the geezer. Yeah. Yep. The geezer. We can also sedate you. Scorpion tenders no longer capable of walking. What a what a lucky guy. Uh, let's put a prosthetic heart in your chest. We're gonna use the good medicine if I have one. Yeah, yeah, we have sixteen. Please put everybody on purple unless otherwise stated. Freaking glitter world medicine hogs. I can't believe this nonsense. Geezer. Oh, you are pretty hungry. How about. Yeah, yeah. You, you go and do that. You go and eat. And after that, let's get uh, an operation on you. Make your life a little bit easier. Make sure it's Blarga that operates on you. Otherwise, you know, it's freaking open heart surgery. Kind of a big, serious deal. Let's make sure only the best doctor is on top of that. All right, we have two new prisoners. He is infected. Let's quickly um, dispose of all the things. Actually, we could just take his heart and put it in the geezer. Ah, eh, too late now. We can just do another open heart surgery. What's the, what's the big deal? No big deal at all. 
Um, this fella will also get these organs harvested. Great stuff. And really, we can just take uh, take his liver. <laughs> you know? I don't want to keep him. It was just too much of a burden. All right, the geezer now has a prosthetic heart, which is, you know, 80% efficiently efficiency, efficiency. So it's not like a super great mm, replacement. But don't worry, there will be plenty of organs to replace what you got. I look forward to it. Hopefully it won't be effing damage that does it. Otherwise, uh, they have a very high chance of their organs falling apart. Well done. Well done, Blargo. Another organ disposed of. This is great. <laughs> excellent work. Oh, yeah. I can trust Blargo. He's an expert exciser. Of vital parts. Oops. Turns out he couldn't live without heart. Without a heart, people die. This is news to me. I can't believe it. What a weakling extracts his skull. Um, decent grave digger, probably. Probably, you know, uh, he's having a bad time coping with our relative moral differences. Surgery failed. <laughs> They're Meister. They're Meister. You were supposed to help. Instead, you have destroyed his kidney. Shame on you. But you know what? You can't really make an omelet without breaking a few internal organs. As opposed to the outside organs like the penor. But it's okay. Just try again. Uh, it looks like the lung was already harvested, huh? Good stuff. Well done. Now take his heart and his suffering will be complete. You have no reason to keep him around. Hey, Blargo is the real deal. He's going to take this heart. He's going to put it away from his body. The geezer. Let's give you an actual real heart. Let's give you like a double lung surgery. Only we're going to watch, make sure it's Blargo that does it. Recreations being fulfilled. I'm watching. Their Meister might be like all happy about, oh, more cutting people open. Sign me up. All right, he's uh, he's done with that. Yeah, do feed the pemmican. And then I'll make sure that he does the surgery. Prioritize operating. Unfortunately, I'm using up so much medicine. Oh, come on, ge the geezer. Get back to bed, you fool. Fargo was ready to operate upon you. I'm trying, I'm trying to save you. Do you have any idea the amount of money that I'm pouring into your sorry carcass? You have no clue how much this is costing me. Do you have any idea how much these organs fetch in the black market? Hmm? You better appreciate this. You better, you better be just through the roof. The happiness must be unparalleled. As I put all these resources into your body. No, 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 don't strip the geezer. Do I not have another lung? It's possible I don't have another lung. No, no, don't strip. Can I install lung? Missing one lung. I, I guess it never got harvested. I'm just dumb. All right, well, we'll just delete that. Much better. The geezer is going to be doing much better. Really want those... Oh, freaking fox. Murder. Um... Really want those that ray to happen so we can go out and get our relic. It's really uh, delaying the program. Oh boy, the temple is looking absolutely gorgeous now. Absolutely excellent. And now we have that sculpture. We could install it, but no. The entire point of this piece, which bears a representation of an elephant lying in bed while vomiting, and then a large group of dying baboons lay on the ground. <laughs> the geometric style of the central scene clashes with a folksy depiction on the background. Representation relates to the elephant being poisoned by toxins. Oh, a elephant. Okay, so it's not the elephant that just died. It's just a literal elephant vomiting on baboons. 
Well done. Well done, Hike. We continue to get insight upon the shape of your neural makeup. It is truly a horrifying sight to behold. Let me get some home area over here. It is stressing me out to see all this filth. Get all that this stuff covered. Nice. You know, because of the quest is so long as 14 days, the enemies can take forever to show up. Let's do something like that. So the walls get repaired when they get destroyed. You know, get they get shot at. Although really I shouldn't be repairing these. Once this late walls go down, I really should be replacing them with granite or even the plasteel. Because these late walls are pretty damn weak. Anyway. I am very tempted to just set up a caravan to send them out. Not care about... Not care one bit about the attackers that are coming. Just hope that it works out. But what if it don't? You gotta be cautious. There's really no problem if the security systems get activated. It really doesn't matter. Alright, this got replaced. Let me quickly build that fence and that way people can't use this for cover the addition of fences kind of overpowered walls because now with the fences you can have a very uh reliable thing to prevent people from using walls for cover so you can put walls anywhere you want and still not worry about oh shit the attackers are going to be really annoying hey this guy with catharsis dregs is going to be uh, a little bit more uh, mentally mentally stable we're gonna have a conversion opportunity soon. What is the cooldown on the ritual? Still seven days. That's a little too much. Oh, something I forgot that I could do to up morale is to grab some of the some of the prisoners and then execute them in a public display. Should have definitely done. Let's do a shed of the unworthy. I can't get Tubo, huh? Is down. Oh, you can't do a sacrificial ritual with somebody is down didn't know that well let's put some peg legs on his stumps there you go a peg leg and a peg leg for you so that way you can tuck 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 what your way walk your way all the way to the sacrificial altar and we can cut you open for the display of all of my colonists <laughs> you're doing great slave rebellion likely how dare you do I not treat you fairly? As you toil away in your little workstation, do I not treat you with respect and dignity? The answer is no. So why do you have any self-respect left? I just don't get it. You know what you need? More skull spikes to encourage your obedience. There you go. Uh, there's going to be a station here and a station here, probably. So let me just put one there. It's very important to uh, surround the workers with sufficient oppressive imagery. For these minor breakthroughs. Are annoying as shit! Alright. It's okay, let them rebel. What are they gonna do? What are they gonna do? Slap me with their limp wrists? Pathetic. We will just punch them down. Surgery fail. You know, it only takes duct tape. <laughs> duct tape on a log. But sure. Sure. It was too tough, effing Damas. It was just too difficult to put this log on his stump. It was just such a challenge for you. <sighs> All right. It's time probably. I really should be going further into the... Let's do medicine production. Medicine production is such a life changer. You start making the good medicine. And when you have so much of it, you can sell so much. So our giant profit is very, very good. And we bought all that nutriment. So between that, uh, let me also say that the cloth is supposed to come in here. That way there will be a, a good station here. We also will prioritize medicine, uh, herbal medicine coming to the shelf. We got some people that are just idle. It's just too much uh, of a good thing. I have too many good uh, colonists. I have too many mech slaves. There's just no job for dregs to do. Quite sad. 
we're just here waiting for that raid, that stupid ass dumbass raid that uh, is guaranteed to come. It's very upsetting. I want to go out there. <laughs> the geezer is not having a great time. I want to go out there and retrieve the problem solver. But until that raid happens, there's no way I'm, I'm going to dare to do that. All right. It feels like I should have way more psychoid leaves planted. Let me just expand this zone. There you go. Tons more drugs. Since we're going to be producing... There you go. Produce uh, actual medicine. Let's have more herbal medicine. You know, it gives the, the people stuff to do. Seems like we're always out of wood. So give me more wood. There you go. More fiber cord. What? Tried to convert dermis. What is the deal with these two? <laughs> Dermeister is always there to cave Scorpion's head in. What a savage. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> what is the deal? Let's see their, their uh, personal relation here. They're really not, not... No, that's not it. Where's Scorpion? They really are... They tolerate each other. It's not that bad. But <laughs> what the hell, brother? <laughs> getting, getting kind of funky. All right. Largo. You've slept enough. Go rescue Scorpion. Treat her wounds. Please. <laughs> Just to stop. This idiot is the key to for us to be able to get whatever the hell I accepted that quest for. I don't even remember it. Oh. Great job there, Hike. Well done. I think now with uh, with another conversion attempt, we probably will get her. Yeah, 36. This will do it. I mean, I said that I want to convert Dregs, and obviously she's the one that needs it the most. You know, but it really takes forever to this to, for this to happen. If I do Great Digger now, we'll get another devout follower. Let's just do it. Yeah, there you go. Cold to the Blargonites. Welcome for real Grave Digger. You are not a savage dog any longer. You are now an equal part of this colony. Dermeister shall soon follow. Don't worry about it. Hike there doing the Lord's work. And when I say the Lord, I of course mean our Lord and Savior Blargo. He is the moral guide of this colony. And you can tell because of all the virtuous actions that are always happening under his supervision okay so we got a bunch of kidneys no lungs unfortunately does tubo have some peg legs install peg leg on right leg there you go please oh it's not about it's not about the peg legs it's about the abasia you can't sacrifice this idiot because of the abasia that's why. That's all right. Oh, okay. I mean, we, Dermeister is really getting up there with his medical skills. Very nice. Very nice. Well done. They will attack any who may threaten the relic, which is fine. It does create more of a problem when you go get the problem solver. I'm just waiting for... There's so much stuff to do, but I'm waiting for the freaking raid. Driving me nuts. Let's get some more rocks. Hold. I mean, people need stuff to do. Get all these rocks hold. Get some more of the steel slag. Get ourselves some more free steel, pretty much. And we're waiting on research to happen. We got ourselves. Oh yeah, yeah. We got ourselves some flak. Some flak uh, construction. Let's get. Make sure that we can make some flag vest on. Do that you always. Make sure you always have one available. Make sure that it's at least of normal quality and it's a 50 or plus. 50 plus? 51 plus? And anybody can make these. It's the quality of a flag vest. It matters, but not a ton. So we can just uh, let that be. Really, I'm, I'm out of skulls. I have no more skulls, huh? That is a freaking tragedy. The bodies got butchered so fast. Everybody's so diligent. 
in the atrocities against humanity. It's just freaking tragedy, brother. Got this junk hold. Yeah, all the elephants, all the mechs, all the idiots do my bidding. Get all this junk to the place. What, what? Okay, just major break risks. Dermeister, because of his, he's still, you know, hung up on his silly rate justice. What a, what a buffoon. Not embrace the one true faith. Scorpion, though. Grand Slave Scape. A Grand Slave Scape has begun. All your slaves are making a break for it. Ah, you poor bastards. <laughs> They're all wimps. <laughs> Except Afterbirth, who is 61 years old. He is a, a jogger. That will help him out quite a lot. Not. Okay, let's make sure nobody has a sword in his hand, though. <laughs> that would be pretty bad. Okay, after birth. Time to get punched to the ground. You just couldn't wait until the official beating of the slaves, huh? Definitely don't want crack like back me. It's melee attack because he will just chop limbs off with wild abandon. So, Sweaty is actually... Actually, perhaps capable escaping that's truly incredible let's make sure that doesn't happen hike you are going to personally ensure to crush sweaty's dreams because what sweaty doesn't have is a freaking chem fueled <laughs> rocket jetpack <laughs> now time to teach sweaty a lesson look Hike is going to wield her uran uranium mace. Sweaty's head might fly off. That is uh, something I'm willing to accept. Man, this guy, is, uh, he is fast. After birth has uh, bitten dust. He got beaten too hard <laughs> by Cybertrunk. Oh, who was it? They torn off his leg. <laughs> Don't show me the log. Cyber Trunk! Scratch after breath in the left leg. Absolutely destroyed him. Well, the grand escape. They escaped right into the afterlife. What do you want me to do about it? It is how it is. Extract his skull as a souvenir. That is a tragedy. Hike! Show Sweaty the price of trying to escape. Try not to use his skull as a golf ball. That would be great. Okay, fat head is down. Man, he actually got stabbed? Who? Crackling Batman, he wasn't drafted. He doesn't care. He's going to come down there and teach you a lesson. <laughs> okay, Hike. Just smash. What did I say? It's like I can see the future. It's like I have a, a certain amount of experience dealing with runaway slaves. You son of a bitch were wearing a hyperweave button-down shirt and now it's filthy and tainted. <laughs> now everything's freaking tainted. You freaking moron. Mm, I can't even extract his skull. Hike, your zeal is to be commended, but perhaps tone it down a little bit. Because you literally hit Sweaty in the head horribly and Sweaty died. And now we're out of a slave. So, maybe tone down the conviction a little bit. Pretty outrageous. Anyway, it's all their own dumbass fault. Honestly, the slave system, it's kind of stressful. I do slaves because it's funny, but... It's kind of annoying to have slaves. I would much rather just have a giant pile of colonists. That's splendid. Like, I think the whole slave system, while funny as hell, is superfluous. Like, you don't need slaves for anything. It's just a little bit more flavor for your colony, you know? Uh, functionally, you are probably much better sticking with mechs and colonists and animals, and they will cover 100% of your needs. But it's, it's just a nice thing that the game has. It's an extra option of all of the atrocities that you can have. Fun time. Fun time. Crime. Crimes. 
Okay, Blargo's already on it. Okay, good stuff. Right. <laughs> he is on the floor, just bleeding out. I'm a little sad. Because uh, in the end, the Empire Man got trampled by a elephant. An extremely ignominious, humiliating end for the person that we were trying to torture into old age. So that's pretty sad. Sweat is still just being okay. He's no longer, he's no longer around. Don't worry about him. He is now in all of us. Very happy to, uh, you know, for his meat to not to go to waste. Tragic. Still waiting though. This quest is active. Is is happening? Seventeen days. Wonder how long is that? How? Accepted 5.1 days ago, so that still leaves 12 days during which the raid can happen. I'm not going to leave until the raid happens. That's just a way to lose your colony. When you get careless about stuff like that, you need to always be vigilant. I was really hoping for this episode to be the one that we got the problem solver. It's quite tragic. Cargo pods, what you got? It's just uranium, huh? 27 uranium. How exciting. <laughs> How enormously exciting. Okay, is there any resources that I'm down in? We got quite a few rocks. Everybody's being properly uh, processed. All kinds of... All kinds of research going on. I guess we can amuse ourselves by painting some more rooms. Perhaps this time... That's something I, I do like to do is paint the prison into a really oppressive color. Black and red is a little too easy. I think we're going to do something more like um, paint the floor. And we're going to paint this floor a different shade of red. There you go. And that will be like truly madness inducing to whoever's inside this prison. You know... It will make a great impression. It helps, you know. Every bit helps. Of mental destruction. We are slowly progressing toward better stuff. So what does it take to, ta to have this high mech tech? Do you need... Oh, you definitely need a multi-analyzer. And then you also need to make... Um, the Megban antenna. Might as well build one of those, even though I'm not going to call it down just yet. Again, we need to get that get that raid happening, but we can just build it for the time being. This is something, if you haven't played it, you build it, you use it, it's a one-time use, calls a mechanoid threat. Basically, you're spending some resources and then you get into a fight to be able to advance your mechanoid capabilities. we got some good flak vests going on. Our only slave that we got left. Absolutely tragic. But hey, I'm happy that at least one of them survived to craft things. And they, they were useful. They were constantly working on things. So it's not like they weren't making themselves useful. Unfortunately, it's tainted, so it has to go. It gets melted. Advancing that time. How's the, the power situation? Is great. Uh, do I want these? Why do I have these potatoes? We don't want potatoes to eat. We just want mushrooms and ha animal meat. I mean, uh, human meat. We should really plant hops here. Let's plant some hops there. Because these won't be enough. We want a ton. A ton. Of beer. Let's make another row. We'll have some shelves over here for the beer. I think that makes a lot of sense. But we're going to get some extra barrels. Must be symmetrical uh, for as long as I can. Right next to the brewery thing. There you go. Got lots of wood, actually. We can make a ton of these. There you go. There. Oh. Quest available. Temporary workers. Let's make... Not slate, but... Furniture. Let's check out this quest. Count Kairos Birenios. Of the refugee empire needs people to help negotiate a tribe with the tribe. 
How can you delay nine co- Are you insane? The Empire's just delusional. They're just absolutely out of their gourd. If you think I'm going to send nine colonists of mine for 24 days. I do want to eventually have goodwill with the Empire again so we can betray them all over again because that, that sounds hilarious to me. But not for the price of sending out nine colonists. That is just absolute insanity. Let's do something like this. And this will be clear everything, just beer. There you go. And then we'll build a copy. And we'll actually, no, we'll want a small shelf. We want a beer shelf in our in our living room. Phil will construct a marble shelf. You know, it's just four boards, four slabs of stone that you hammer together. How hard could it be? Apparently really difficult. It's critical to fill fill this uh, shelf with beer. There you go. Oh yeah, soon because our hops are soon to be fully grown. We're gonna have so much beer, baby. It's uh, it's the, my favorite thing to sell. I don't know if it's even profitable at all. It may be cheap, best to just sell the hops. Oh, I don't know. Either way, excuse me. Murder thrust. Just uh, clear the allowed area. Animal filth be gone. Make sure they don't eat my freaking hops. Don't eat my psychoid. There you are. You may go in the pen if you like. There you go. You may go in the pen if you like and eat the hay grass. I accept that. Man, drag is always sad. Medicine production. Hell yeah. All right, so we want neural superchargers. How come I haven't gone there? I, we need to get that ASAP. Medicine production. It's time. Make medicine. None of your coins have these skills. Craft an intellectual. Oh, because that's because. Um. Actually, we want make four medicine, right? There you go. Uh, because a slave may not do intellectual work, which is upsetting. It does make sense, though. But for making medicine, you could, you know, lore-wise, you probably don't want your slaves to be creating your medicine. It's probably a bad idea, considering the nasty things they can possibly put in there. Contract prison. Oh, yeah, yeah, we were like, oh, maybe I should do it. Maybe I should do it. Four prisoners for an enemy faction will, with no place to store them. Sammy wants you to watch over them for nine days. Nine days is so much, dude. But prisoners are actually way easier to take care of because they won't roam around insulting your own colonies, you know. Um, we have plenty of food. And these raids are easy. So the problem is that they may all come together. <laughs> That's pretty bad. I do want this Arcotech leg, though. And this is also nice. Silic Neuroformer is also super nice. This is some, some really good rewards. We should definitely accept this for one or the other. I think we won the Arcotech leg and the Tech Proofs. Tech Prof Super Sona Core. All right. We got a pile of idiots. Everybody, rescue them. There you go. They're doing their thing. They will be uh, a little annoying to take care of. But honestly, it won't be a big deal. Mad Gazelle, huh? How worrisome. <laughs> of course, there's a freaking clean sweeper around. t Rose. quickly take care of this. Murder! Don't miss! Of course you missed. <laughs> I mean, that was... Go in there and do it. Freaking t -Rose just got bitten by a gazelle. How threatening is that? Ow! Death! Why is your damage, you piece of garbage? Freaking gazelle! Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> That's so stupid. Ah, sometimes. 
It's so dumb. All right, go repair the clean sweeper. And now here we are in the the waiting room. The waiting room for raids. This is so dumb. Please. Okay, they're all being treated. Oh, jeez, I should have definitely looked. Make sure that they are all in medicine me uh, uh, and herbal medicine. Otherwise, they may have wasted my medicine, but thankfully, yeah, they are all in herbal medicine. Let's create some more of these. Why not? Let's do it like that. Castaneda, Lucky, Jane, and German. Amazing. All right. It's okay. Conversions will eventually happen. We're almost off cooldown. And the ritual must be pretty close now. Four days. One more conversion and then we'll be ready. What? Not letting people walk in. I didn't realize that they would be able to walk. That is annoying. They may stage a revolt with five prisoners in here. It can be a problem. But you know, you just line up and then punch them. Punch them real good. Should be... Should be easy enough. I hate that they get fed. The damn... Prisoners. Uh, we could increase the experience of social, but I don't want to do that. Um, please. Why are they being fed anything other than simple meals? Just give them simple trash. Freaking lavish. Are you nuts? I have plenty of simple meals, right? Yeah, just this nasty ass simple meals. I wanted some violence. I wanted to uh, get raided. But just watch. They're, it's all going to happen at the same time. And it's going to raise the freaking colony to the ground. I look forward to it. I suppose in the next episode. Because it ain't happening in this one. At least we got a hilarious slave revolt. <laughs> and just, uh, you know, a little readjustment of our numbers. It was for the, it was for the greater good. good. Don't worry about it too much. By the way, hike. Before I forget... Get some more conversion attempts on dregs. Do you see dregs anywhere? Do I need to go find her? Dregs, where are you? You're actually sleeping. Hike. Come over here. We're gonna get this done. Wait. Where's Hike? There's Hike. Conversion. 49%. Alright, we probably will take two more. Maybe one ritual will do it. Either way. Waiting for those raids, they will definitely happen in the next episode.